Okay, so tomorrow morning is the girl's fifth birthday, and the five is backwards. Okay, this is what I used for weights. Some of the balloons, it weighs down a lot more than the others. Um, this is just a little something for them to see when they wake up. Um, they really wanted these. Um, they open up to these like, I don't know, um, vanity cases. And they saw it on um, the Miss Katie channel. Um, my girls are obsessed with any Russian speaking YouTuber, so they watch them constantly. And she had it and was playing with it and they just would not stop talking about it. <laughs> they wanted it. So on top of that, um, you know, it is December 8th. Um, their birthday is extremely close to Christmas and Hanukkah and New Year's and we celebrate all of that. So um, we don't really give them anything huge, although um, we did get them bikes for their third <laughs> birthday, but you know, three-year-old bikes are not that major. So, um, I also, um, got them a little, um, vanity set. <laughs> and then a relative who asked me, sorry, I'm losing light because I'm going into rooms that have no light right now. Accept my beautiful tree. Isn't it stunning? Ooh, the glow. Anyway, um, so yeah. And they got them this, which, um, it's beautiful. I did say that they're getting a vanity set, but wasn't listened to so they have an extra one I don't know where it's gonna go I think it's gonna have to go into um, yeah I'm using my phone um, I think it's gonna have to go into their um, bedroom because <sighs> no space in the playroom um, let me show you the playroom can't get over the tree oh I got these things let me see if I can find it okay so um how do i do this see this come on glow there we go see this these things smell like pine and um they came like three in a pack so legit my tree there's another one right here if you can see it Ugh, right there um yeah so my tree legit smells like real pine. Oh, I just dropped it. Oh well. It is a mess. We have a little tree for them here. Um, so I bought this little cute nightstand at a yard sale. And I ordered a stool on Amazon, which I'm going to put together right now. Oh my god, this room is such a mess. I never clean it because I want them to clean their own stuff. But because I want to present it nicely, I'm going to have to do something about uh, this. So yeah, so I have a little stool that's going to go right here. And I bought a little mirror that's going to go here. And I bought little like pretend play makeup and things they can put in the drawer or use it in those cases so yeah um and then um i will show tomorrow morning i think five is a big number i mean one we celebrate because it's the first birthday you know and then we do obviously a little something this five keeps turning and i don't know how to make it stop turning um I don't know oh well um so yeah we do you know kind of small birthdays for two three four 
Um, but then five, I think, is another big one because you're five years away from double digits. So, um, yeah, so we're doing something kind of big. Um, but in the morning, I'm going to make some pancakes and I'm going to put candles in the pancakes. Um, so it's going to be a fun morning. I'm going to have to get up early. Oh, well, anything for my babies. Um, and I was thinking maybe these gifts aren't enough, but honestly, um, they have over 35 kids coming to their birthday because, um, there's two of them, they're twins and they're in separate classes. And, um, we just invited everyone in the class. You know, I didn't want to leave anybody out. Um, they didn't want to leave anybody out. So, and family, friends with kids. Yeah, it's a lot of kids. Um, so what we usually do is, um, and we do this every year, so they're not upset about it. Um, they don't ever, ever make a fuss about it. Um, they know that this is just a part of the tradition um, is, if you like my little Costco, I've had it for years and they still sell them. Um, but yeah, so, oh, the light is horrible in here. I made it worse. Here we go. It's a little better. <laughs> a little bit. Um, but yeah, they know that um, every year, whatever gifts they get. So the big ones that they get from us, um, family members, like big things, obviously we keep, but then the gifts they get from their friends, they each get to pick out two to three, depending on how many they're getting. Cause some people bring two gifts. I always say, don't do that. One is enough for both of them, but everyone always brings one for each child. So, um, because of that, they each get to look at the pile, pick out two to three gifts and the rest we donate because it's December 8th. So it's perfect timing to donate the toys to, um, an organization that gives the toys to kids that have grow up in families that don't have the money for the gifts that their kids want. And they know this and every year I collect and the amount of toys that I bring, they always ask me what company it's from because it's that many toys. Um, but this year I think they're going to be old enough to come with me and I want to volunteer, um, sign us up, um, to do something, maybe help them organize the toys so they can see, you know, which home is getting what, I don't know, something, but, um, yeah, um, I think this time of year, I always tell them it's about giving, not receiving, and the fact that their birthday is so close to all the holidays, it's, I mean, they just, they don't need the amount of stuff that they get, so I think the perfect way is to donate, um, I know in the school that they go to, a lot of the kids, uh, parents in the invitation put no gifts, please. Um, nobody ever listens. I've done that before. Nobody listens. Um, so I found that it's better to just accept the gifts, but donate them. So they're going to a good cause and they never make a fuss. I mean, we'll see this year, but you know, up until, I mean, it hasn't happened yet, but every year, I mean, when they were one and they were two, I didn't really ask, but three and four, they knew, they knew that you pick out what you want and the rest is going to kids that otherwise wouldn't get gifts or these kinds of gifts. I'm glad that we can do that. Um, I'm glad that 
I can teach them to give and to be good people and to understand that giving is important on so many levels that we are so blessed and so lucky to have what we have in life and the way that you say thank you to the universe even if you don't believe in religion just the universe you say thanks by giving back so that's how we do it and um, I hope they grow up repeating the tradition so um, I will show you how tomorrow morning goes okay so I cleaned up the area a little um, more like move things to the side <laughs> I really don't like cleaning up their stuff because my parents never used to clean for me and it taught me to clean after myself I'm still not amazing at it but at least you know it taught me something <laughs> so um, I try and do the same thing by making them clean their own space and if I clean it for them well what am I teaching them they even love dishes I mean even I don't leave dishes and again I'm not great at cleaning <laughs> so anyway um, this is the little stool I got and um, I got ooh, this cute little mirror um, it turns on the back but you can dim it I think you gotta hold this button there we go oh, or just hit it there we go there we go okay so super cute it has these little puppies in it um, and I got them this fake makeup it feels just like real makeup but it doesn't actually put any color on their faces because they're five I'm not gonna let them wear makeup but it still um, has the feel of real makeup so like when they touch my makeup um, the brushes um, the powders the um, roll-on lips everything I mean it feels so so real but it's not which I love and then um, I got them this little set um, of you know fake blow dryer that makes sounds, curling iron, flat iron. I mean, these are all things that they see me do um, at my vanity and they always wanna copy me, but obviously I'm not gonna let them touch hot, hot things. So um, I think it would be cute if, you know, they played hair salon and did it to each other, but they're at that age where they want to experiment with the things mommy does but <clears throat> again too young <laughs> to do it with the real stuff and um all of these things are three plus so i could have gotten it for them years ago but at three i still think they were a little young so yeah um as i was saying <sighs> um at three, I still wouldn't have got it, gotten it for them because I think three is a little young to, I mean, three is kind of the age where kids are so impressionable. Um, it's when their brains are really, really being molded into young little adults. And I didn't want to give them something like that and say, oh, you're girls, you have to play with makeup, you have to, you know, do your hair. Um, I mean, you know, I would get them educational toys. Yes, I would get them one or two things that they wanted, like a doll, but um, for the most part, their gifts were educational, and that I thought was more important than pretending to put on makeup. Right now they're five and pretend play is a big deal to them. 
it's what they love to do so there's no harm in it um and i think they're gonna really enjoy um the pretend play with the makeup and the hair and all that um especially since they asked for those um cases whatever they are but another thing that they really really wanted and someone sent it to them and I have no idea because it came in an Amazon box and it was addressed to their names there was no note inside who it was from but it was a microscope like a kid's one a talking microscope and I just opened it and I was telling my parents that it was something they wanted, but my parents got them tickets to the Nutcracker. So I know they wouldn't have gotten them something on top of that. Well, n no, <laughs> I shouldn't say it like that. They would have gotten them something else, but they wouldn't have sent it to the house. They would have just handed it to them. Um, so I don't think it was them. Um, and I no idea maybe they um told somebody else but yeah i'm gonna have to get to the bottom of <laughs> who got it um <laughs> i thought it was someone um <laughs> a friend who said that it, she was sending him a gift and i said texted her and said oh my god how did you know they wanted this and she was like oh it wasn't me so um yeah put notes and things you send people. <laughs> but um, I'm hoping they're gonna, I, I mean, my kids, I can't say that they're perfect by any means or any stretch of the imagination, but they're good kids in the sense that for the most part, they're really appreciative of pretty much anything that they get. Um, I mean, especially things that they've wanted, but they're at an age where, you know, something new is something new and something like pretend play with makeup and hair is something they've never had. So that's very new for them. So I'm going to film their reaction, but. I'm pretty sure they're going to be excited. We'll see. Oh, and in the theme of <laughs> educational toys, I couldn't help myself. Um, they're just learning English. Um, up until this year, they've only um, they would only speak Russian and Armenian. Um, my husband is Armenian. I'm Russian. I've said it before, and so my kids have not spoken English and now that they started pre-k they are learning English and they're doing pretty good but one of the things they're having trouble with is the alphabet um so some of the letters like a b c um a is a in Russian um b is different this um b in Russian is a v um, the English N is an E and the English H is an N. So, um, oh, and the English P is an R. So, yeah, a bit confusing. We do have other letters. Oh, and the <laughs> English R is actually the same letter but backwards in Russian and it makes the sound yeah. So, um, O is an O, but um, there's other letters that don't look anything like that. Um, there is an E, um, but the E is a yeah. <laughs> there's two of them actually. I mean, Russian alphabet has way more letters. It's way more confusing, but because there's so many letters that look the same but make different sounds, it's 
hard for them right now um, to pick it up. I mean, they're just learning the alphabet and getting in in one language and now they, you know, their brains are very, very moldable to language, but the writing, reading aspect of it, um, it's still a little difficult. So I got them this. Um, it's also for age three, but um, I thought it would be perfect for them um, to start, you know, they, they would know exactly where each letter goes and A is for alligator, B is for butterflies, C is for snail, D for dolphins, E for elephant. Um, I love how each letter has a picture of, so H, horse, easy to remember, J, jellyfish, K, koala, I mean, N, nails, I mean, it's so, so, like, I love Melissa and Doug um, puzzles, they're amazing, I've always gotten it for them, so, in the theme of learning toys, this is another one that I got for them, and, um, it doesn't go with the theme whatsoever, but I'll find a way of presenting it to them. <laughs> it's not going to be at all as fun as all the other ones, but it's needed. So, yeah. Um, I'm going to show you one more thing. <laughs> so, in the theme of Christmas, their birthday. Um, so, this cardboard little advent calendar huge boxes um i got this on amazon and i'll link it below because i think it's amazing um in the past i've always gotten them advent calendars you know with chocolates and things and oh it gets boring this i can keep for years and years to come and I can fill each box with different things. Like one day they'll get chocolates, another day they'll get stickers, another day they'll get, I don't know, another small toy, and then maybe again some candy. So, and they're big enough. Like, I mean, look how big that is. They are really big enough for two of something, um, which is great because I don't have to buy two advent calendars anymore. And in the future, when my son is old enough, um, I'll have to fit three <laughs> of something. Um, but what I was showing you was not that. It's just next to it. So um, we have a little sneaky elf. And he actually doesn't arrive until the day of their birthday. We talk about him, he, that he's on his way, and he's coming, but he doesn't actually arrive until their birthday because it gives them something to look forward to. And um, I also say that, you know, if you're not good, he may not come. So it's kind of a fun little thing that he arrives on a sleigh on their birthday and he will be holding some kind of little gifts um i could get something that they didn't get one of the days because they were being naughty so they didn't get anything in their advent calendar so i think i will put it in elf's lap that he came down on the sleigh for their birthday with little gifts. Yeah, I think that'll be cool. Okay, it's super early. But somebody cut up even earlier. It's seven. It's seven thirty now. Got them to stay in bed a little. But I think they really want to No, 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 mother see, mother see. I didn't even get a chance to go downstairs and turn the heat on. 
Hopefully it's not freezing. Стойте, стойте, стойте. Я хочу, чтобы вы подождали. Идите ко мне. Идите, иди сюда. С днем рождения. Happy birthday. Мои большие девочки. Мои big, big girls. Happy birthday. Supposed to stay up for 24 hours. Yeah? Let's see, maybe we can glue them here. Oh, oh, аккуратно. Аккуратненько. Вам не холодно? Это от братика, это чтобы вы буквы учили. Their brother got them. Вашего братика? Какого? У вас один братик? А хотите еще что-то посмотреть? Да. Идем сюда. Положи, оставь это, Лен. Ничего, Положи. Окей. Okay. Wow. 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 косметика, косметика настоящая. Нет. Wow. 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 Они падают все время. Uh -oh. Pancakes are not meant for candles. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Anessa and Aliana. Happy birthday to you. It's a little early for daddy. He's still sleeping. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Now we're going to get to pick what we want. Hold on. Okay. Getting ready. Herb with fruit. I used to put the fruit inside, but now we got some picky little five-year-olds. So it's better to do it this way. Окей, по одному, кто первый идет? Я! Окей, выбирай один, который ты хочешь оставить. Этот? Окей, ставь на свою сторону. Теперь, Аляна, ты выбирай, какой ты хочешь оставить. А что это? А ты же... Давай посмотрим, что это. Or molecules. Это, это, это строить надо. Из этих штучек ты должна строить зверей. Я люблю. Ты хочешь это? Нет. Окей, иди возьми, что ты у точно хочешь. Куку эту, кукучку эту. А, я сама она сама выберет. выберет, она сама выберет. Вот это? Да. Рисовай? Да. Окей, прекрасно. Ложи на свою сторону. Арам, не трогай. Окей, Анесса, выбирай еще один подарок. Арам, но-но-но. Чей-то она выбивает. Арам. 
he's not helping the situation here. Okay, выбирай еще один подарочек. Это? Окей. Бери на свою сторону. Алиана, выбирай еще один. А давай посмотрим раньше, что это. Я не знаю, ли тебе это нужно. Давай что-то интересное посмотрим. Может быть... Эм... О, да, браслетики делать хочешь? Да. Нужно делать браслетики, видишь? Или пазл. Смотри, смотри есть пазл. Ой, есть пазл. Хочешь пазл? Окей. Анесса, еще один можешь выбрать подарочек. Ой, спасибо. Мой будет еще одну эту губу. Но это Алиане подарили, поэтому если Алиана захочет, ты выбирай еще один. Ты можешь хочешь чтобы рисовать? Нет. Ты не хочешь чтобы рисовать? Я люблю вообще-то рисовать. Ты любишь рисовать? Ой, смотри. Вот это, это бит, можешь э, строить что-то. Но это немножко опасно с братиком. Значит, если опасно... Хочешь портфель не... такой? У вас есть ничего? Ну, ничего. Ну, я хочу лучше Мулану. Мулану еще могут накинуть в воду. Ну, вы же у Деда Мороза попросили куклы, которые будут плавать. Ну, окей. Ой, саму такую хочу для украшения на моей, на ты, моей спальне. Ты будешь украшать это? Да. Окей, бери. Ой, спасибо. Только... Ой, это это чуть-чуть опасно с батиком. Тут батик поломает нам. Тут батик поломает, но я буду следить. Окей, хорошо. Аляна, что ты еще хочешь? Я не буду конфетки. Нет, конфетки не, не надо. Что ты хочешь? Хочешь? Ну, машинки для Барби у нас есть. Давай это не будет. Портфельчик? Окей. Окей. Все. Вот. Ты, ты выбрала три. Ты выбрала три. О, очень разные. Интересно. Да? Да. Она что выбрала... Куклы и рисовать штучку, а Алиана выбрала портфель, пазл и чтобы рисовать. Уже у них, знаешь, да. свою. Это все идет бедным детям? Нет. Я еще хочу портфель. Портфель? Окей, okay, иди возьми. И тогда Алиана еще один может взять. Нет, ты уже нет, ты 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 взяла, она ты уже взяла четыре, вот у тебя будет четвертый. Какой ты хочешь? Абсолютно. Ну давай, Алиана, один, еще один можешь выбрать. Хочешь такую куклу, то что она взяла? Аккуратно. Я не знаю, он или он в машине. Да. У тебя четыре. Очень разные у вас. У тебя портфель, рисовать вот этот аул и две куколки. А у тебя, покажи, что куколка, портфель, пазл и рисовать. А вот это все пойдет бедным деткам? Да. Вау, wow, окей. Okay.